This Saturday is Judgment Day when the Ospreys face Cardiff Blues at the Principality Stadium. Join us to look ahead to the game now with Hanno Dirksen and Ben John. Ben, Judgment Day this weekend, Cardiff Blues here at the Principality Stadium. How are preparations going for it? Yeah, good, exciting. Um, especially where we are today, it's, uh, it is exciting uh, leading up to this weekend. And the boys um, have been training well the last couple of days, so there's a lot of excitement in the camp. Obviously, to repeat the last year's fixture, it was a bonus point win for the Ospreys. Yourself starting and finishing a try as well. Uh, more of the same this week is the order, I think. Yeah, we're gonna we're gonna go out and well, the last couple of weeks we've been playing that way, so uh, that's the way we're gonna look to play. Is just get the ball th- um, with a lot of energy, throw it around. So uh, yeah, hopefully, uh, yeah, hopefully it'll go well for us. Up against a Blues team who are probably the form team in Wales over recent months and they've nudged up ahead of us in the table. With two games to go, if we want to get that sixth spot, can't afford any slip-ups. Yeah, definitely. But this weekend, that's what we're looking towards. And as you said, Cardiff have been playing well, uh, but they've been playing open as well, which uh, suits our uh, brand of rugby as well. So it should be a pretty exciting game. As one of the boys in the squad who haven't got full international honours, you come to the Principality Stadium, it's looking as if it's going to be very close to a sellout. Uh, it's going to be the type of experience that somebody like yourself can really enjoy and thrive on. Yeah, it's well, last year was the biggest crowd I've played in front of, but uh, this year seems to top that again, so um, it's going to be massive. And I just had a little look in the uh, change room as well. Well, change room's never been there either, so uh, yeah, it's pretty exciting yeah, for the weekend. But as much as a sense of excitement, the boys have got to be professional, get the job done and really deliver from the first whistle to the last. Oh yeah, definitely, yeah. It's, um, that's our main focus, is to get that result. So, um, yeah, that's about it, yeah, really. Just making sure we got our roles right and the, the way we want to play. Everyone um, knows what we're doing and hopefully we'll go from there. And if we get that, it builds up a humdinger of a game against Ulster at the Liberty the following weekend with sixth place very much up for grabs then. Yeah and obviously I think Ulster may have something to play for as well in that top four spot so uh, should be uh, should lead into a very uh, very good finish. The Ospreys head to the Principality Stadium in Cardiff for Judgment Day 4 this weekend. With over 63,000 tickets already sold, you can still buy yours from the WRU for just £10. Head online to wru.wales to book your tickets and be part of the biggest ever Pro 12 crowd on Saturday. Kick-off is 2.30pm. You also have a merchandise stall at the game with up to 50% off all stock. You can also take advantage of the April sale by popping into the Liberty Stadium Club Shop or going online at shop.ospreysrugby.com. Next week sees the final game of the Pro 12 season with the Ospreys taking on Ulster at the Liberty Stadium on Saturday the 7th of May with a 3pm kick-off. With two games remaining and a top six finish still possible for the Ospreys, it's all to play for, so make sure you are there on May the 7th to support the cause. The Ozone will be open at 1pm. There'll be an outside inflatable village which is open to all supporters on the day. If you haven't got your ticket for the match, you can get yours now either popping into the ticket office or going online at ospreysrugby.com slash buy tickets. The Black and White Lounge is also open for the Ulster game. For just £69 per person plus VAT, you can enjoy a fiol reception, sharing platters and player visits. It's the best way to cap off the season, so call our hospitality team now on 01792 616 488 or email hospitality at hospitalityrugby.com to book your place. Hurry as places are strictly limited.
I know, here we are, Principality Stadium. Just a few days to go until Judgment Day 4. How much are you looking forward to it? Yeah, looking forward to it. Um, it's going to be, a, like, a, like you see, an uh, amazing stadium and hopefully it's going to be a, a really good crowd and good atmosphere. You know, something as a player you look forward to in play, playing in front of uh, people to come watch in an amazing stadium. So, um, yeah, looking, looking forward to it. This year got more on it than ever. You've got the Blues, who are the form team in Wales at the moment. You've got the Ospreys and them desperately trying to hunt down the top six for Europe. Just two games left to go the season. There's a lot on it. I definitely want to finish the season on a high and uh, uh, hopefully we can put in a, a good performance in, in a good stadium against uh, a very good team. So um, bringing that to our last game against Ulster at home and uh, we've got to chuck everything at it to, to um, get the two wins in to be able to get the top six. So, um, you know, we want to finish the season on a high, like I say, and um, hopefully it's going to be a, a good occasion for us to do this. How much can you actually enjoy the occasion and the 60, 70,000 crowd? when there's so much on the game. Do you have to get the game done or do you actually enjoy what's going on around you and the experience? I'll definitely enjoy it, but you, you just focus on the, the job on the day. So hopefully you're not, um, not uh, you know, hopefully you can focus on the game uh, in, in the noise. So some players are not used to that. So hopefully we can, uh, you know, just focus on the, the job on the day and uh, put in a good performance and hopefully get the win. And if we get that win, it builds up an incredible last day of the season. I'll start at home with Europe still a possibility. Yeah, definitely. If we get the win, you know, we're going to hopefully have a good crowd at our home home turf. And, uh, you know, Ulster is a pretty good team as well. So we're going to have to get everything right and uh, get the two wins and aim to get into top six. That's our, you know, our main, main goal for the end of the season. That's all for now. Don't forget, tickets for the final game of the season, Ospreys versus Ulster at the Libby Stadium, are on sale now via all the usual outlets. Buy ours and support the cause.